Good morning, everybody. It is Sunday morning and 7.30? Yeah, 7.30. And I got up and got started right away on laundry. We got up about 5.30, I guess. I got started right away on laundry and shower and, you know, just the normal stuff. I forgot my coffee. And, um, by the way, I... I don't know why when I vlog my hand is like way up here. Like why? I, I just feel like if I have it up here, you guys can see more things than just my face. You know what I mean? Like I don't know what you want to see, but I feel like it's more entertaining if it's not just like up in my face. Anyway. So I'm trying not to because maybe somebody said maybe it's the way you hold the camera that you're getting headaches. And I mean, it very well could be. So we're going to try to do it more head on. Anyway. Um... So I'm about to film Topic Tuesday. I need to close this. And, oh, I need my rings. Apparently I'm single right now. Um, and then that's the last thing that I'll be filming, aside from vlogging today, until I get back. Unless I film next week's Topic Tuesday before I leave. Oh, hi, handsome. Why are you shaking your head? All right, sorry, we had to have a little pause in the wardrobe discussion. Um... I did walk in and say hi, handsome, though, before you were shaking your head. Yeah, thank you. So. <laughs> You're not telling me anything I already don't know. Oh, boy. I, I don't even know what to do with him Folks. sometimes. Folks. So, um, I'm going to film is what I was saying. This morning, and I can't tell. No, it's still, I can feel that. I woke up, and my neck was fine. Um, I was hugging Bob. And all of a sudden, I'm all broken out. So I don't know if I had some sort of a weird something to scruff or I don't know. I don't know, but you broke me out, honey. He was like, sorry, I'll never. I don't know what to tell yeah. <laughs> That's what he was like, sorry, I'll never hug you again. <laughs> I don't know why. It was very strange. So, all right, I'm going to change this laundry around and then um, film Topic Tuesday and then check back in. So, all right, I'm, I'm through a couple of three loads. Two loads of laundry? I don't know. Two loads of laundry. Third one's just about done. Um, and I was going to show you, I did try to save my old navy blue plaid shirt again um, by using Dawn. And I have used Dawn before. I've used that trick before. I didn't think about doing it on lip gloss for some reason the first time. Um, but it helped a little bit, but not really. You can still kind of see. <laughs> but that's all right. I mean, live and learn. You got to live and learn with your mistakes. So, it's 8.19, we, we need to leave in about 20 minutes. So I'm going to fold this laundry, or hang up the laundry, whatever the case may be, and hopefully edit my video, get that converting while I'm gone, and then uh, we're actually going to take separate cars because I'm going to go right to Green Bay from there to handle my errands, and he's going to come home. So yeah, that's, what, that's what's happening. Oh, and yes, I changed my clothes. I uh, What I was wearing, I just wanted to wear that for... Um, the video because it was St. Patrick's Day. So <clears throat> this I'll show you really quickly. And I'm just going to put on those Mary Janes that I have. Those Mary Jane heels. So this is a sweater I got at Maurice's a long time ago. Um, they they tend to bring the style out again with, with different colors, like colors of the season. So this kind of has that wrap um, sort of finish to it. You can see like that. And then just a black tank. These are um, slacks from Lamb Bryant. Three quarter length. I have these earrings on that I got from Diane yesterday. So, um, I can't remember if I said today is the day that we joined the church. So I'm, I'm assuming that we won't be out of church like at our normal time because I think you kind of stick around and meet people and that sort of thing. So, although we've been going there for, well, almost a year now, so we know most people, but anyway. Um, so yeah. Oh, I should put a bracelet on. These are the random things that run through my head. I just want to show you how beautiful it is out. And then indeed all of our, I can't remember if I showed you, but indeed all of our snow is gone. Da, 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 da. Although Bob and I are both convinced that we'll probably have at least one more. I need to put these, I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to put these away because it's so pretty. <laughs> Such a door. Um, anyway, Bob and I are convinced that it's going to be, um, oh shoot, we're going to have one more snowstorm, we're convinced. Look how dashing he looks when he wears his whole suit. Back up a little so they can see you. I mean, really. <laughs> delightful, honey. You're delightful. 
So it's 10 to 2, and I am home from Green Bay. Look at this one. Lounged out, eating some Funyuns, right. watching some basketball. Oh. <laughs> and I will show you what I got. First of all, I want to say that I went to the Fleet Farm by myself. Only because I wanted to get some stuff to make um, some trail mix to take with me. So I thought I would show you guys what I got at the Fleet Farm. So, it's the, it's the cheapest place to buy nuts and like raisins and that, so. When I'm making um, trail mix, I always get the jumbo raisins now. And I got some dried cranberries, cashews, walnuts, and almonds. So I'm gonna make a batch of trail mix. I'm just gonna mix all those things together. And then I'll leave half here for Bubba. And I'll take half with me. And then I'll show you what I got. I went into Lane Brandt just because I wanted to, let me see if I can pull some more natural light into here. Let's open these bad boys up, shall we? Um, I have my drying rack here with all of my jeans on it. So I went to TJ Maxx and got Bob a new belt. Should go over there. And then I bought this really pretty bright coral blazer. Hopefully you guys can see that. Um, and it is kind of that stretchy material. I have a black one that's similar to this. So this needs to be pressed. But, yeah, I like it. Hoping that's showing up right on camera. So at any rate, it's a blazer and it's coral. And then these are my church clothes. And then the other thing I got is I went into Torrid to return those things. And I ended up getting a pair of, let me see what they call them. The All Nighter Pant Skinny, the Noir collection. So they're just kind of fitted. They kind of look like, they're probably like a jegging sort of thing, but they're just black. I don't know, I mean, I don't know what to show you aside from they're fitted down to here. They're a little bit long on me, but I think if I wear the right shoes, they'll look okay. So I got those, and then I just got a pair of black, like, trouser pants that also need to be pressed. Oh, boy. I feel like I'm going to have to break out the um, iron, and I'm not happy about it. Maybe I'll just, I don't know. I'm going to have to iron. And, yeah, that is it. That's all I got. So, I need to, I'd like to go for a walk. And I need to make peanut butter cookies yet. And the badgers are on. I have one load of laundry left to do. And other than that, other than that, like that's nothing. What do you have to say for yourself, my friend? Anything you need to accomplish today? Nope. This is it, right? Yep. Just here and watch the Badgers. Yep. I may, um, I may walk and listen to the Badgers. I haven't quite decided yet, but. All right, I'm going to go put those clothes away and maybe pull out the iron. <laughs> we'll check in a little bit. All right, so here's what's going down. It's halftime. The Badgers are down by one. How are you feeling, honey? Are we still confident? What? Are you still confident? <laughs> well, sure, he says. It was a little half-hearted, though. Um, so I have made... This is just what I package up to take with, with me, and then I have the rest of it here for Bob. Some trail mix. This is out because I'm doing a couple of pork chops in tomato soup in a crock pot. Anybody else ever do that? My mom did that um, when we were growing up, and it's really good. It kind of tastes barbecue-y like. Was that what you would say? Sure. Barbecue kind of like? Yeah, sure, yeah. Yeah. You're a dork. Uh, <laughs> how about, do you see how he's not nice to me? Um, anyway, and he's being like that while I'm busily making him tuna salad. Yeah. For when I'm going to be gone. All I want right. to make sure he has enough to eat. So we're going to have chicken stir fry tonight, and he'll have leftovers of that. I'm making the pork chops for tomorrow, which he will eat. I'll have something else when I get home from choir because I don't get home till late. And then there'll be a pork chop left over that he can have. So you'll have tuna salad, leftover stir fry, leftover pork chops. I mean, what more could you ask for? I don't know. I don't know either. He's currently making his cherry juice concoction. It's good for the joints, right? Yep. He does that. Do you do that once a week? Yep. Once a week, two tablespoons in water. That's how he drinks it. 
Anyway, so I have my, the last load of laundry that I had to do that. I don't like to leave it in the washer or dryer while I'm gone, so I'm doing the last load of laundry. And yeah, just kind of working along here. I'm gonna work on the cookies while the Badgers are playing the second half. Yep. And then when they're done, I'm going for my walk. Okay, then. <laughs> there you go, now everybody's up to speed on the plan. As an update, there's four minutes and 47 seconds left in the game. Up until just a little bit ago, the Badgers, well, a little while ago, the Badgers were down by 11 points. That one says, it's over. <laughs> He's getting all fired up, you should hear him. I can't have the camera on because some of the things that are coming out of his mouth are not appropriate for our YouTube channel. He's in the restroom right now, or I'd have him say something, but. <laughs> it's tense, it's very tense. And he, I said, uh, you need to calm down, you're yelling too much. He said, uh, no. I said, if I was yelling this much, you'd be yelling at me because when I'm watching the Packers, I can get pretty mouthy. And uh, like loud, I mean. And he goes, no, this is a special year. I said, so, so if I was yelling as loud as, as you are right now, it would be okay? Yes, this is a special year. <laughs> right, Gabe? Yup. <laughs> Back to his spot. I'll show you uh, his position in a minute. This is the game is really close position, Bob. This is the coach. No more, <laughs> no more lounging. I can't take it, which is why I'm baking and cutting vegetables and doing things for the week. Yes! <laughs> Oh, it's getting good. Eight seconds left. Tie game. Michigan State has the ball. And overtime. I can't take it, honey. I can't take it. Look at this face. <laughs> Wait, let me zoom in. <laughs> yeah. I don't even know what to do with myself. I can barely take it. And with that, what's yeah. your reaction? Yay! Big Ten tournament and regular season champions. And I'll have to say, I was wrong. When they got down by 11, I thought the game was over. I thought Michigan State was going to win it. But nope. I always say, it's, you judge a team by how well they can take a punch in the mouth and come back from it. And the Badgers mm -hmm. were down by 11 points. Came back, they tied it, sent the overtime. Yep. Uh, and won the game by 11 points. Hey, you're pretty Michigan serious. State didn't score. Sorry for you. Yeah, Spartan I'm sorry fan. if you're a Spartan fan, but yeah, we uh, we skunked him in the overtime. They didn't score at all. So, pretty excited about this. Um, never ever, I asked Bob, or did I say that on camera? I don't know, but never ever have the, the Badgers had a number one seed in the tournament. Nope. So, we're pretty excited. So, selection, the selection um, special or show or whatever starts in about 15 minutes so his victory still is gonna have to be delayed so i'm gonna whip up he's gonna go down and get the vegetables out of the freezer for me and i'm gonna whip up dinner and we'll have that and then well, the i can't talk we will have that while we're watching uh the selection and then uh he can go have a stogie and i'll go for a late walk that's that's the plan so i just have some oil heating up here in my walk and some chicken and then this is what we're going to use for vegetables. This Supreme Stir Fry comes with this packet of sauce and vegetables. So I just did half and half. This will go back in the freezer. And these are the veggies we're going to use. I don't know if I said, but I'm using sesame oil, by the way. It's one of the ones that I think is okay for a higher heat. Dinner is almost ready, but they started... The selection started... So, this is the Midwest region. This is who we think Kentucky will be number one in, right? They are. Oh, they did that already? Yeah. And there you have it. I use these a lot, these rice, brown rice in a bag, um, because I don't have rice. So, there's some rice under there for him. <laughs> and then I just have vegetables and chicken. As I sit here waiting for our number one seed to be announced, I would like to report that the pretty serious nail polish, while pretty, does not wear very well at all. Look at that. That's like 24 hours. Not amused. Same over here. Not amused, I tell you. Not amused. And there it is. Wisconsin getting the number one seed. Oh, there you go. We are pretty excited. Are we not, game? Oh, we played Oregon last year. Oregon. The ducks. the ducks. The ducks. 
Well, currently we're playing. We're not playing them. We're playing Coastal Carolina. Yeah, I know. I'm talking about the second round. Oh, second round. So his phone just probably told him that they got a number one seed. So with that, I think we'll probably end the vlog. I have things, other things to do tonight. I've been go go going, but I got stuff to do. How about you? What do you have to do? I have to smoke a victory stogie. <laughs> I, uh, I got full, and so he has both bowls over there because he had to finish mine for me. Yep. You have to take one for the team. So we hope that you guys had a great weekend. Thank you so much for watching. Um, as a reminder, oh, I, I just like to say Wofford. 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 Um, just a reminder, you will not see us until you won't see a, a vlog now for two weeks. Unless I get something up in between now and then. So, uh, yeah, not this Friday, but the Friday after you will see a vlog again. Um, unless I, I know I just, I'm taking a break. I'm for sure taking a break. So, All right. thank you. <laughs> what do you have vacation. to say? Are you going to, are you going to do any vlogging while I'm gone? Probably not. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing with that thing? Scratching my head. It's good. Ah, yeah. <sighs> anyway. We'll see you guys Remember, in a couple... you said you could edit anything, so... I'm not editing that out. Why? Because I'm going to leave it there for the world to see. Okay. Well, whatever. Whatever trips the world's <laughs> All right. We'll talk to you guys soon. Have a good couple of weeks. Bye.